We're here with the Sick Puppies, your host. It's it's such a great honor and delight to be with you guys because uh, I saw you guys when you played a show at the Mint really? about five years ago. There was 12 people in the audience. I remember that show. I was number 11. I remember, yeah, I remember all those people too. My name. Except me. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. That's that's yeah. That was ages ago. That was a while ago. That was another uh, another lifetime ago. That was before our first record was even finished. Yeah, and I literally I I, I remember just thinking how special you guys. Oh, were. thanks, man. And I, I, no bullshit. I, I just remember thinking how special you guys were, and that how hard you guys rocked, and that you guys were absolutely gonna be. You guys were gonna be something. Oh wow. Yeah, I mean, so much so I went up to your manager Paul after the show and, and got his information and, and everything, but. And it's been five years since you've heard from him. It's been five years. Yeah. Fuck him. <laughs> <laughs> he's over there, actually. Yeah. Right. He's, he's eating. Say hi. Yeah, he's, uh, he's making Between all of the attractive celebrities. <laughs> right. Who are everywhere. That's neither here nor there. Yeah. <laughs> um, what, is it, what is it like for you guys to, to think back to a show like The Met where there's 12 people in the crowd? Now you, you everybody knows the sick puppies. Well, not everybody. I think that's what we're trying to do. Get everyone to know. But it's it's an interesting thing. We just came back literally yesterday from uh, Europe, from the UK and Europe, where they've been playing our music, but we haven't been spending as much time there. So we didn't play the twelve people, but we played about two hundred people, which is different to what we normally play a thousand or two thousand now. And it sort of was a reminder of, of going back to that place when there weren't as many people in there. However, the difference was that everyone already knew the words and everyone had bought the record. So basically, we uh, it's kind of like a, an instant visceral, visual reminder to that, to that place. But I think it's good to do it once, but you don't want to go back. It's nice to be where we're at. It's right. fun. But it's, it's cool to look back on the event show and see how far we've come from there. It's kind of cool that you were there. It's pretty, yeah. pretty amazing because not a lot of people can say that. Oh, yeah, man, there's only 12 people that can say that. Yeah. The good old days. Yeah. Seriously, there's 12 in the world. <laughs> and you talked to two of them earlier today. They were there. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I did. I talked did. to two of them. They ended up signing you to yeah. their label, Rock yeah. Mafia. Unbelievable. Yeah. Are you going to say something? No, no, no. no. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. I think you've you got to catch it. Yeah. Now, you guys are on the Weekly Top 40 Countdown, the Rick D's Weekly Top 40 Countdown, which we're, we're in Australia. Yeah. Um, which is. Hi, Australia. Hi, Australia. Nice to you. Uh, yeah, seriously, it's a good time to be there yeah. right now. It is. It, it is summer. It's perfect. I think it's joking. I know, but it is. Uh, it's still a good time. Yeah. Not so good. Yeah, lots of flooding going on there right now. God, anyway, but uh, what's what's going on for you guys this year? Oh, I know what I was going to ask you. Oh, one minute. See, they're giving us a wrap up already. The first album you guys did. Didn't you, you found like a, a dead deer on the side of a road or something like that? Oh yeah, you know, you've done your research. Found a deer, uh, had been hit by a car on, um, off my Holland Drive. Went back at 6am, uh, put garbage bags in the back, put it in the back of the car, drove it up to the front of the white picket fence house, and took a photo of it with headphones on and called the first EP Headphone Injuries. And uh, yeah, and that was really, it was good. It's interesting coming from the first EP, through to the record we have out now, Tripolar, and then also going in to record uh, Polar Opposite, which is the new record we've got coming out that's going to be an addition to it, a deluxe version. It's basically going to be an acoustic version of all of the songs that are on Tripolar. And we're touring that from March all the way through the end of the year. So please, anyone, go to sickpuppies.com, find out the dates, and come out to the shows. Guys, thanks so much for sitting down with us. Stay away from dead animals, <laughs> at least until the record is done, okay? That's good. We'll, 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 we'll stick with it. Thanks for having us.